So can you purchase Herbalife products from other countries? Welcome back to my channel everyone, this is Jean here from Authentic Energy. Right, so I am so excited to address this um, question today in this special you know, Herbalife FAQ special episode because I know a lot of you guys have been asking me this question. Can I buy Herbalife products from your country? I'm um, in say, you know, India. Can I buy Herbalife products from Hong Kong or Canada? Just an example, right? Okay, so before we get into the meat of today's video, I do want to uh, let you guys know that it is actually not encouraged for people to like always look at other countries' catalogs. So if you're already a regular Herbalife customer or if you're a Herbalife member, it's actually the best for you to stick to the catalog, the product range that you have in your country, okay? And of course, you know, if you do happen to have the opportunity to purchase from other the countries then you know why not right so now I'm going to explain to you how you can actually purchase products from other countries and how you cannot actually purchase Herbalife products from other countries at the same time okay now firstly you have to be very clear with what kind of Herbalife membership that you have okay so if you are a preferred member okay just a preferred member with Herbalife then you know according to the current Herbalife preferred membership rule is that you cannot actually um, purchase any Herbalife products from other countries okay so only products in your country where you're registered okay however if you're a distributor or you're a Herbalife member but it's just member because I know that the preferred membership is not available in all the countries not in all the 90 plus countries so if you're in one of the countries such as say Greece okay there's no difference between distributor or preferred member it's just one membership okay one type of Herbalife membership then you are um, you may be able to actually purchase products from other countries okay so that is the difference, the big distinction you guys need to know. So if you are clearly signed up as a preferred member, then you cannot, okay? But however, I know Herbalife is working on maybe updating and changing the rule for the future. So keep your eye out, you know, keep your eyes peeled for like maybe some rule updates, okay? So now, if you're a distributor, then you are able to buy products from other countries however conditions applied <laughs> okay so now I want you to really pay attention to like what do I mean by you can purchase them conditionally okay so um, in my knowledge and in my experience the two ways there are two ways for you as a distributor to get access to be able to purchase products from other countries other than your country okay the first method is for you to travel to that country okay if you happen to be in a different country let's say you're from um, you know Hong Kong and you travel to the USA and you're like you know what I'm here traveling and I want to try the US products what can I do so what I have done in the past and what I recommend people to do is for you to basically look up where is the nearest Herbalife distribu distribution center in the city that you're in okay so maybe it's it may not be in the city that you are you know visiting okay so if you say for example if you're in a city like Los Angeles okay and then we know that in Los Angeles there is a big there's a big Herbalife Center a distribution center that you can actually personally visit then obviously you can you know pay a visit in person and make your purchase make your product purchase there in person right so the dis distribution center is open to all members all members distrib distributors from around the world as long as you have the Herbalife ID with you right and then they're able to access like the computer system and you're able to purchase you know the the products that's available in that local country okay so this is an example right so next time if you're visiting the UK if you're visiting I don't know France or somewhere you know and you're like hey you know what I really want to try you know the the catalog in your country because you have certain products that I don't have in my country then you know I recommend you to go and visit the local center and make the purchase in person okay and then you can bring them back in your suitcase okay so this is method number one that you actually purchase them in person in the other country 
Okay, now method number two is if you're not physically there, however, let's say, you know, you are interested in trying the products, the Herbalife products from, um, let's say, Greece, okay, and you are not physically there. However, you have family and friends that live in Greece, okay, maybe certain cities, right? So what you can do is, you know, as a distributor, okay, or a general member, you can actually, you know, go online, go to myherbalife.com and select the products that you want, okay? You actually have to go to, let's say it's Greece, right? You actually have to go to myherbalife.com, the Greece site, okay? So if you're based in the USA, you can't just log into the USA myherbalife.com because you are only accessing the US uh, products. But now you want to access the Greek, the Greek products, right? So you have to log into the Greece website of My Herbalife, okay? And then go have a look at the catalog there and select the products that you want, okay? And then you put them into your shopping cart. And now here's the part. You have to actually have them shipped to your family or your friends that live there, okay, locally, okay? So you ship them to their address so they receive the Herbalife products that you, you know, purchased, okay from the Greece site and then you can actually you know ask them nicely and go you know when are you coming to the US can you bring them over to me or maybe you can like work out something where you know you pay them uh, the Korea the shipping money so that your family and friends could actually you know maybe ship them over to you right I know that the shipping will actually cost a lot so I don't really encourage that but um you know I've done a couple of times and then I just feel like it's um a big favor personal favor and a big hassle you know to ask your family or friends or relatives to do for you so i've only done a couple of times uh, but what i've done is that if i know that i have friends visiting me here in canada and they're flying in from like hong kong they're flying from australia or some other countries i'll always be like hey is it okay well, especially if you're very close to them, like my mom, okay, or someone that's like your bestie, uh, if they're not too close to you, I feel like it's just too much to trouble other people with, right? But like my mom, she was visiting me a couple months ago, and before she came here, um, I just asked her, like, is it okay that I take a look at the Australian catalog, and if there's anything that I like, can I have them shipped to your home, and they just bring them over to me here? And she said, yeah, sure, why not? So I did that. Okay, and so this is something that I recommend. Okay, so two methods. First method is you visit the local distribution center in person, purchase the products there in the other country. And second method is for you to basically ship them, you know, to the local address and then have your family or friends and, uh, you know, have them bring them to you okay um so these are the two methods that i recommend so now speaking of shipping right i do want everyone to know that you cannot actually even as a member or distributor you cannot actually buy herbalife products from another country just by simply going online like on herbalife.com myherbalife.com does not allow you to operate like that you can only get the products from your own country that is shipped to you domestically right there's no international shipping like I, I want to buy something from UK and then they will ship from UK warehouse to me over here in North America. It doesn't work like that. Okay. So this is something that I want to basically clarify this video for all of you. Okay. So one more thing I have to mention here is that um, very often I get um, inquiries from a lot of people that are from countries where Herbalife is not available. Not available meaning that at the moment Herbalife is not authorized to be, you know, traded and to operate you know um in that country right because of i think a lot of times it's just um because of geopolitical reasons right and maybe other economical reasons right um that you know herbalife is not available in that country and then you know people from that country really want to you know get a hands-on herbalife then what do we do okay so firstly if you do find if you're from a country that doesn't have herbalife available like officially then if you find them on like amazon or some like e-commerce website my advice for you is don't buy them because you don't know the legitimacy of those products you don't know if they're like real or fake or expired or you know fresh so don't do that okay because that is not really like the legit way to get your products okay however um, you know, legally, what I could actually advise you to do, if you're from a country that you can't get your hands on Herbalife, you can't find any distributors and it's 
you know, Herbalife is just not available in your country. So what I would suggest you to do is, uh, do you have uh, family and friends that live in a country, you know, nearby you? Okay, so for example, I'm trying to think of an example. Okay, um, uh, recently I had a couple of inquiries from Luxembourg. Okay, so people in Luxembourg, they really want Herbalife. And uh, Herbalife is not, you know, available in Luxembourg. Okay, there's no office, there's no HQ whatsoever, it's not authorized there. So, but however, Luxembourg is very close to like countries like France or Germany. Um, yeah, so France and Germany. So I will ask the people, you know, do you have family and friends that live in France or Germany? So maybe if you're really, really serious about the product, maybe what we could do is, you know, like I could actually set up the shipment and, you know, have the product shipped to your family or friends in one of the nearby countries right and then you are able to get them from your family okay so um i know this sounds complicated but this is probably the closest the legit way for you to get access to herbalife okay if you are serious about trying the products right um so i know that this has worked um, for many people in the past uh, however i know it is not very convenient but this is like what i can suggest you Okay, so if it's not in your country, if you really, really want to try it, um, you know, do you have family and friends that live in a country nearby you? Okay, and you know, you can go to the Herbalife website and have a look at, you know, which countries near you that actually have Herbalife available. Okay, and of course, you know, if you guys still have any questions about it, uh, feel free to get in touch with me on my Instagram or email, right? And if you guys want to get started on a Herbalife program and Herbalife coaching with me, you can find out the details on the description below of how to get started okay and of course let me know in the comment below where is everybody tuning in from okay i know a lot of you guys watching me here are from uh, like us india canada south america i mean south africa and different countries in south america as well and the philippines big shout out to my friends in the philippines um but i'm just really Hello. happy to be here to give you guys the support and of course any questions put them in the comment below i always check my comment okay so thank you so much for watching today's video i hope i answered this question nice and clear for you guys and of course you know if you have more questions write them in the comment below and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell all right so take care guys i'll see you next time bye